She's a good girl. Hey guys. Hey. Welcome to our channel. My name is Philemon. And I'm Michelle. If you are new here, welcome. And if you're not, welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> so today we are still close to DC in National yes. Harbor. Uh, it's a staycation. So we are off for the next two weeks. And if you've been following us, you know that this is our second time at the harbor this year. You know what? You're actually right. Yeah, we were here in the summertime. Yes. It was hot. It I was remember very complaining hot. it was hot the whole time in that video. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you for coming back to our channel. Um, so as I was saying, we are at the National Harbor at the Wyndham... Where are we at? Wyndham National Harbor? I don't know the, the name. Club Wyndham. Yes. Club Wyndham National Harbor. Wow, you were right. All right, so we are here for four nights. Um, thank you, Michelle's parents, for <laughs> sponsoring, <your laughs> this. sponsoring this trip. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is just a nice vacation for us. Um, nothing planned. I don't think we have anything planned. Um, we're gonna just try yeah, to just relax. Relax. Relaxation is all that we have planned. What did a Whitney little R and R? Whitney, relax, relate, release. Relax, relate, release. Look at you now in the show. I'm Dwayne. You're, you're Whitney. Yeah. It's Whitley, but you know. Okay. Uh, Laura, stop turning the lights off. Thank you. Um, please stay tuned for lots of great stuff uh, today. Uh, okay. Someone should be watching her. Someone should be watching her. Um, her grandparents. <laughs> uh, Laura, stop. <laughs> do not do it. Okay. And okay, so we. Wow. All right. So we will finish this <laughs> intro in the dark. So thank you for joining our channel, and we will see you all in a little bit. Stay tuned. Oh, man. It is windy. <laughs> Can they even hear me? Probably oh, not. Oh yeah, probably not. They can't even see me. So we decided to stop at like this little market across the street from our hotel. And they don't seem to have much, but it mm. should be enough to like get us some breakfast and some things so that we're not spending too much money on restaurants. Man. You want yogurt? Yes, ma'am. Today, I'm money. I figured we could like make sandwiches. Do you want? I got ham. Do you want like turkey? Six ninety nine for some lettuce. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Do they got tomato? Cluster. I just want one. Boom. Boom. Bop. Beep. Ooh, grapefruit. So we ended up, well, we were going to go to Nando's to get dinner, but they are closed. Yeah. I don't know, like, if, like, for good or, or what's going on with that location, but, um, we ended up instead going to the Walrus. The wal the Walrus Oyster and Ale House. We've been before. Yes, mm -hmm. they have really good um, seafood. Um, so if you ever are at the harbor, definitely try them out. Um, we're eating their food now. I think that's some type of vinaigrette. Whatever, we're gonna put it on there. So yeah, we got crab cake, salad, hush puppies, a like little combination platter of just shrimp and oysters because they are out of stock of scallops. I don't know if there's like a scallop shortage or something. Um, and Allure is eating leftover mac noodles and cheese. And yeah, from Noodles and Company. Yeah. Is it good, Allure? Uh, no. Nah. Oh, and we also stopped at Furlo Cheesecake. Mm. So I didn't realize that was here. At the, I didn't know they had a storefront, but basically those two women that were furloughed from the federal government a few years back, they started their own cheesecake yeah. empire. <laughs> um, so we picked up a banana pudding cheesecake from them and a sweet potato, sweet potato pie cheesecake yeah. from them as well. So hopefully it's good. Um, but they only had miniature sizes. Cause they said they are getting like so many orders that the family sizes and the couple sizes were like, you have to pre-order to get those. Yeah. So yeah, so now we're just gonna Hi. eat dinner. 
yeah, we're just gonna eat dinner tonight, share some cheesecake, call it a night, and I don't know what we're gonna do tomorrow because, again, we didn't plan anything. We're just relaxing. Hi. Do you guys share it? Bye bye. Bye bye. See you later. Good morning. It is 7.46 a.m. Day two Ooh, of staycation. Okay. Alora, say hi to the camera. Say hi. Say good morning. Good morning. Yes, good morning. So, that's, what's the game plan for today? Come on. going to make breakfast. Breakfast. And apparently it's super cold outside. 21 degrees outside today. So, the so first we were going to try to go to Tanger Outlet to do some shopping. I mean, but We can probably still go. No? We may have to find an indoor mall in Pentagon or something. Oh, Tyson's. Oh, boy. Well, uh, I, have I don't know. Maybe not because, you know, Omarion variant. So. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we'll I mean, probably do some online shopping. <laughs> Alora, what do you want? Hey, Jinx got on my head. You want a pouch? Yeah. Okay, so someone wants a pouch instead of eating real breakfast, so. Oh, well, we're gonna have some apple and broccoli for breakfast. Just a, it's not for breakfast. Apple. You want broccoli and apple? You be saying stuff now. Girl, your lips are chapped. Say thank you. Thank you. All right. Okay, all right, so let's, uh, Start cooking. Let's. Are you gonna be helping? <laughs> like I said, let's start cooking. Woo! Chef Boy RD in this kitchen. Okay, so someone does not want to eat breakfast today, I guess. Here we go, Laura. Is that your bacon? Mmm, bacon. All right, so what do we have here? Some bacon, toast, eggs, <laughs> and potatoes. And Laura has fried apples, which she doesn't know that she likes yet, but you okay? Yeah, so that's all we have. Bon appetit.
Yes, it is now evening time, day two of staycation. It's 5 o'clock p.m. 5 06 p.m. I like to be exact. Thank you. Now we need to figure out what we're going to do for dinner. Yes. Because I'm starting to get the hungry bug. Hungry, um, hungry. Hey, po. We're hungry. <laughs> the what's, what's wrong with you? Um, we are going to order in again. I was craving a steak. I'm trying to do some research now to see which one of these restaurants near us has a good ribeye. Yeah. And Phil's not hungry. So. I'm not really hungry. I've been snacking all day. We had a uh, candy, Auntie Anne's <laughs> pretzels, pretzels, a yeah. lot of them. I had my first, what do you call them? Pretzel dogs. It's like pretz it's hot dogs inside pretzels. Uh, it was all right. I would not. I prefer corn dogs to pretzel yeah. dogs. Yeah. So yeah, I'm, I'm full of that. Also had candy, um, which is always great. So I'm not really hungry. So I might just eat off her plate. And then when I'm hungry at night, I have you some... You can have an ounce or two of my steak. We're getting a 14-ounce steak? You have two ounces. So I get like... No, I have four. I like to have four ounces. You can have 10 ounces. It's sounding like we're going to need to get a 20-ounce. How many ounces do you want? <laughs> we'll see what the restaurant has to offer. Okay. All right. So let's order this food. Peace. All right, guys, so we just finished eating uh, dinner. We are heading to the the game room. We're not really sure where it's at, but uh, hopefully we can find the game room for Laura so she can burn some energy and go to sleep in about an hour and a half. All right, so see you at the game room. Day three, we are at the Gaylord and we're looking for some fun activities for the little one. They seem to have a lot going on here, so we're gonna see if we can get into some fun. Alrighty.
Good evening. So it is now 5.30 p.m. We are on our way to get some dinner. A quick recap. As you guys saw from the footage, we ended up going to the Gaylord and they have a lot of activities to offer. Um, the only issue is that Allura was just too young for the majority of the activities, pretty much all of the activities. So she um, was a little antsy. Um, so we ended up leaving there quite early and went back to the room to eat lunch and take a nap. So now <laughs> Allura is wide awake, as you may can hear in the background. So now we are headed to get some dinner from one of our favorite um, restaurants that's actually at the wharf, not at the harbor, uh, Kaliwa. And if you all have been following us, you know that we went there for Father's Day. If not, check out that vlog. So we will update you guys uh, after dinner.